everybody. Welcome back. This looks interesting, right? What this is, is a flower pot mold that has a little girl's face on it. I've turned it inside out because I'm getting ready to put the paint on it. Uh, the reason I went ahead and just turned it inside out right now is because you can't tell what it is from the other side anyway. You'll see it on the other side anyway. Anyway, anyway. Um, so these right here, this part right here is flowers. Those are her eyelashes, which I'm going to paint after. She's got a tiny little nose. She's got her hand to her mouth. She's got a braid here. This is her hair. It goes to a braid. Her hair is here. Her hair is here. I had to look all this up <laughs> to figure it out. She's got on a little tank top. This is her arm, but this is a tank top, so I need to put a little color on the tank top so she doesn't look naked. Anyway, um, I'm going to get started on this. I am going to start with her hair. I want to do it in a mahogany brown. So what I plan on doing is I plan on doing the flowers, her hair, her shirt, and I think that's it. And then I want to do the color of the resin, kind of a... Um, oh, uh, not... Not like anyone's specific ethnicity. I don't know how to explain it. I, think, I don't know. I want her to just look suntanned, beautiful, ethnically, who knows. This is what I want her hair to look like. So, anyway, this is going to take a while. That's for sure. Um, so, feel free to... Do go forward um, sit and listen to me talk I'm sure some of you like to put this on to go to sleep because <laughs> uh, it can be mm. <laughs> talking and talking and talking <laughs> I just realized that she's got to have the whole back of her head done in the in the brown. That it's going to take forever with that brush. Let me find another brush. It's not all gunky. Aha, 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 aha. A really nice makeup brush will be just fabulous. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think about that this whole back part is her hair until I just saw the way they've got it swooping. Need more. Hopefully not that much. But you never know. So let me whew. <laughs> uh.
I love, <laughs> please don't get mad at me, but you know what? I actually really loved being on lockdown, not having to go to work. <laughs> I loved it. Even though my company like, oh, had us up and running in a day or so with computers at home. So I didn't really get. Well, hello everybody. Okay, we're back and I have mixed up my resin and I am going to um, color the resin now. I am using um, this resin. MTB JZJ. It's a one-to-one -one ratio by volume and um, non-toxic, safe, crystal clear. 
I actually really like this resin um, ever since I saw a review on it I was just like blown away that it's a pretty good thing anyway you'll see and so I didn't get up until I don't know I slept for two or three hours but I'm not sleeping much at night so two or three hours is nothing <sighs> so I'm, I'm getting on the average three to four hours at night but <sighs> I don't know maybe it's because I'm getting older I wonder about that because I know sometimes old people don't sleep I'm not old I mean I may have been on this earth for a long time but I am still like the sixth grader <laughs> My body doesn't agree, but you know what? I can complain all it wants to. My brain is like, no, let's play. Let everybody else be the adults. I was an adult for a long time. I was a single mom. Woo we for 18 years, 20 years, 18, 19 years. I don't know. Until my kids moved out and they were like 21. Um, so I have been the adult, like total, total, total adult. No partying, no playing, no nothing while the kids were little. So now you know what? My my brain has gone, come back, come back to child. So I'm putting in a little bit of the Let's Resin Resin Dye Caramel. Caramel, caramel. Just a little bit. I'm going to probably put more white in there. But I want to see what this does first. And I want it to be opaque. I do not want it to be clear because this is going to be a planter. And her skin, and I don't know. So uh, I need some more white. Maybe I should just use some white paint. You know what? I think I'll just use some. Why not? I'm going to use a little bit of white uh, acrylic. Snow White, no less. Okay, so I'm just going to use some of this. Because I know that even though this makes the paint, makes the resin act a little bit uh, funny, this is pretty good resin, so I think it'll work out just fine. I don't know if you can see me stirring and stir, stir, stir. Oh, this is so much nicer. I just mixed this up. This is a little bit extra. And there are, are so few bubbles in this stuff. Oh, it just makes me happy. All right, I need more um, color. I'm going to try the stuff I got off Timu. <laughs> Why not? Coffee metallic? Oh, I just love it when this stuff hits the resin. And it just starts spreading out and going bananas. I just love that. Yeah, I think I'm going to want this to be a little pickled by this. Okay. Is it see-through or is it... I think this will be good. Skin is hard. So this mold, it looks ginormous, right? It looks so big. But it does have all the way, my finger fits almost all the way in. Um, so it's really not that big. This is the part here that probably holds more than anything. But let's just do this. I'm just uh, tired of being so nervous about this mold. I'm so scared. I'm not going to be able to unmold it. And you're going to see me lose my mind and grab my my, <laughs> my razor. Just slice it open. Oh, please be enough. Please be enough in here. Oh, no. Oh, I can't make this color again. I don't know how. Oh, please, come on, come on, come on. Oh, my goodness, oh, my goodness, oh, my goodness. Come on, 
Don't leave me hanging. Oh, maybe. <gasps> maybe, maybe, maybe. I'm going to stop right here real quick, though, so I can do some squishies on it. Let's see. Where would she need to be squishied the most? Maybe her flowers? Maybe just everywhere. Oh, I like the molds that have the hole in the middle. Because you can stick your, your fingers up in there. And then you can really get a good squish and get everything up and out of the way and all the bubbles up and out. Oh, I like this resin. Oh my goodness, I like it. I think it's just because um, uh, Naked Fusion has just had me in such a tizzy lately. So many bubbles and this one's just like normal. Here they come. Oh, oh, oh. No more. As soon as wait, one more try. There's a couple coming up still. Oh, there's a couple more coming up. Okay, come on guys. Come on up to the top. The weather's fine. Come on out. That's one thing I hate. hate. I shouldn't say hate. I don't like the summer. I overheat. I don't like sleeping in warm. I like to sleep with my feet hanging out, even in the winter. Um, well, talk about San Diego winter. So it's not that shocking. But the one thing I'm really excited about the summer getting here is like right now in here in my little place, I think it's like 68 in here with no heater or nothing. I don't have a heater or an air conditioner. And uh, the resin is working. Like, I'm just so happy about it. Yeah, I think I'm going to be a little short here. Please, please, please. Come on, come on. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Come on, I don't want to add any clear... Big problems doing that before. Okay, come on. Come on. Please, please, please. Come on. Come on. You know you can do it. I can squeeze, as they say, blood out of a turnip. I can get resin out of a cup. Oh, oh don't spill it. Don't spill it. No, 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 no. Don't spill Nope, 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 I need you. I need you. <laughs> well, I really wanted to use this for another project, but I guess I'm going to have to at least put a little bit in there. It'll be okay. I don't want that to um, like float up there so I have a big clear resin spot. I don't want that. All right, do some black by uh, Let's Resin. I'm gonna put like nine drops in there. Let go of my gloves. See how dark that is. Not dark at all. Get it all mixed up in there. Very translucent. I need to get some black mica powder. I really do. Black onyx. I'll just use this. Start to run low on my little uh, black diamond, my black diamond colors. This is black onyx. Give it some shimmer. I'm going to really give this some shimmer in a minute. Put quite a bit in there because I want it dark. I'm going to get that all mixed up. Yep, that's a good. And I have this Lumineers. I love these things. And I'm going to use the Halo Blue Gold. Um, you see this is black right now. 
Let me get you over here in the middle, get you out of the way, put you right here, and let me make sure you can read it. I can't see it myself, where is it? Halo Blue Gold, Lumiere. Man, I love these things, they're metallic. They're so cool. Usually when you add them to black, it does crazy stuff. So I'm gonna add about four drops. Five. Okay, I'll put five drops in. We'll see what happens. Ooh. Okay, I want you to see this. Just a few drops into this black, and you get this crazy effect that I just love. Love, love, love. I don't know if you can see that. Ah. Uh. How can I make you, how can I make you see it so you'll know why I love it? Can you see like the green in there? I'm gonna put, even though it's blue, halo blue, blue gold. I'll put a little bit more in there. Mm -mm -mm. Put another three, four, and a five. Don't tell anybody. I'll put in five. So cool. I'm trying to get it to where you can see it. How can I do that? Oh, Taco Bell. You'll have to wait till the morning and then you'll see how it comes out. I'm also though going to put in um, some of my favorite black. black. It's called Iridescent Black from Michaels. I love the way this comes out. Put a lot in there. I just love it. It's one of my favorite things. Because it's got such a pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay, wait a minute. I want more. More, please. <gasps> Oops. <laughs> Okay, well, it's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let me get it all mixed in so that it's not just right there. Okay. Let me go like that, like that. I don't know if you can see that green in there, the colors in there. It's so cool. Come on, fill up. Don't give me a hard time. I don't want to be scraping the bottom of the barrel again. Because you are the bottom of the barrel this time. That's going to work. Let me get some of this glitter essence in here, up here. Yeah, let's do that. Ooh. Might be enough to make a little bear. Fill you. Oh, let me squish it first. Oh, it's only the top part. <laughs> the bottom is like a rock. right there. Come on out. Oh, I don't know if those are bubbles or if that's, uh, oh, you know what that is? It's resin that got stuck to the top. Oh, okay. Let me uh, go do a little wipe down in there. From all the pores that I did, there's a little bit of resin bubbles, in, not bubbles, um, you know, those little dots you get. Okay. Oh, okay, maybe a little bit more. There we go. Yay. Feels good. Ah, 
I'm going to do something with this last little drop, but I'm not going to keep you waiting anymore. So I will see you in a few minutes. But for me, it will be hours. Okay, you guys, I hope everybody has a great time today, tomorrow, tonight, whenever you're watching this. Maybe you're a night owl too. So good night or good morning. See you later. Well, hi. Hello, everybody. Back and terrified to open this. <laughs> oh, Lord, you'd have mercy. One thing I'm afraid of is that I'm going to not be able to get it out of this mold. However, let's proceed. Let's do our unmolding. Oh, my goodness. It's not even like stuck. Oops, but I can see that her skin color is that of a... Um... Alien. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. So, this mold, please be a strong mold. Oh, she's got a big head. <laughs> this must be how my mother felt. <laughs> Birth to me. I have a giant head. I wear the biggest size hat that they make for men. I have a ginormous noggin. Oh my goodness. Precious, precious. Precious. Oh no. I'm in love. Oh, I'm in love. Oh. Well, she has a little birthmark right here, but, you know, birthmarks are beautiful. She has a few little birthmarks from uh, turning the mold inside out. But, oh, have mercy. I love it. Oh, okay. Oh, my God, I love her so much. Mm. My goodness. Okay, so let me unmold the other stuff. <sighs> I'm so excited about her. I can't even stand it. I can't wait to make more. Oh my gosh, she's so precious. But even with all her little boo-boos, and even more precious with all her little birthmarks and stuff. Oh, even though. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. okay. And then this is a, an easy one, always. That's a little bear. With, okay. So basically, we just have a little, doesn't he look like a sumo bear? You see that he's all like, I'm rough and tough. <laughs> this is one of those little tiny bowls that Barbie will use to make a cake, which I think come out just adorable. Just absolutely adorable. Probably shouldn't touch it too much yet. My mold is so loved. <laughs> so used. It's, uh, it's in that cute little bowl, just like a tiny little bowl. Oh, I live in a fantasy world, and I'm not moving, so I don't care what anybody thinks. I'm staying in my fantasy world where I feel happy. Oh, my God, I love her so much. Oh, my goodness gracious. Okay, so I'm gonna, this is the my left uh, resin, you know, my one of my deposit molds. Um, it's actually a wishing jar mold, and what I'm doing for, I always, what, what I'm doing for those of you that um, are not that familiar with resin yet, and you're learning all the little tricks and secrets to how to do it, don't be afraid, whatever. Oh my gosh, I used to be so afraid I would see the resin commercials. You know, people on YouTube, I'd see them pop up in my, my feed, and I'd go like, oh my gosh, no, it's so scary. But you know what? It's so beautiful and addictive, and I can't even explain the joy that, that I get from the resin. Just making things and... Oh, I have never made this before. So this is the wish jar. I think somewhere around here I have uh, 
somewhere around here I have, um, let me put my mold back together, because that's the first time I've ever used it. I didn't even realize it had a lip on it. Yeah, this is just all my leftover resin. Okay, back. Hold on. I need my, my heavy-duty glasses for this. <laughs> These are my... Look at the... Look at the <laughs> I hope you don't see the top of my head. Okay, so I am going to fill in her little eyelashes. Come on. Oh, I really need some of those pins. No, come on. I really need the, uh, what are they? Acrylic markers. Yeah. I watch Marvelous Artsy. Love her. <laughs> um, and it's Marvelous Artsy, all one word, and it's A-R-T-Z-Y. Not S, but Z. How's it working out? Funny thing is with these glasses, I can't see the computer screen, but I can see this really well, and maybe too well. <laughs> I can see all of her, her beautiful little, beautiful little um, gifts from nature. Angels' kisses. That's what we call birthmarks and moles. That's what I call them. Those are my angel kisses. I'm covered in angels' kisses. Ooh, the mole. Is that, is that, oh, <laughs> It's so cute. But I also got to get my head down here so she doesn't end up looking like she drew her <laughs> makeup on with the Sharpie. Though she literally <laughs> is. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> that just gave me a giggle. I can't help it. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to look like she drew her makeup on with the Sharpie as I'm drawing it on with the Sharpie. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see something here. I don't think I can we get a little spits of alcohol. I don't think I don't think mama spits could get this out because uh, I kinda wanna just fix it a little bit. <gasps> mercy, 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 if you aren't just precious. Oh, she needs her little wing of this eyelash to come up here a little more oh, oh my gosh people 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 oh oh my goodness i'm just so overwhelmed i'm so happy i'm gonna try to find a little red and give her some tiny little red lips but i do have a little bit of artificial greenery i don't have any of the little cactus yet Oh my gosh, people, 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 is this, oops, I don't want them to fall out because I want to show her up like this, I don't, but I don't want my old crummy hand in there either. Let's see. Oh, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Oh. I'm just dumbfounded how happy I am how she came out and I can't wait to get her little cactus succulents and get them in there <gasps> I just can't wait oh my goodness and make her some sisters she's like a little fairy oh, I'm just so happy oh wait a minute what about if I put a little bird oh my gosh because I got this little bird wanting to put it on on the, oh my goodness oh my goodness look at that oh the little birdie loves her too oh that would be so cute look how i can't make it stay on there but see how cute that is oh my goodness she's gonna have a bird on her shoulder oh y'all thanks so much for uh, sticking with me and um, please if you have any questions that I don't know any questions at all about resin about love <laughs> put them in my comments and um, 
I'll answer them on the next the next video I do. And if you wouldn't mind subscribing and hitting the like button, that would help me a lot because I really want to grow this channel. I really want to share my love and joy and oh, just complete happiness with resin and even polymer clay and I mean so many different things. I want to share my love with everybody and I want to be part of the community and um, that's, that's, that's enough begging, right? So anyway, maybe I will put some lipstick on her and find a little cactus and give you a photograph of her. Oh my god, I love her. Oh, it makes me so happy. Okay, bye-bye.